Hello everybody, welcome back to another Slow It Down Thursday video. I got another easy knot for you guys to tie today. We're going to be tying the full Windsor knot. Uh, the full Windsor knot likes to uh, project confidence, so a lot of people tend to wear it during a business situation, or it's even good if you guys have a job interview. Now normally, uh, the Windsor knot is uh, suited for widespread collars, just because you can make it a little bit wider at the top here. But if you guys have a shorter collar, it'll still uh, work out and still look good. So just let me take this down and uh, we'll get okay, started. So let's get started. I have the wider end on my right shoulder and I have the smaller end on my left shoulder. And for this knot, it, it likes to eat up all this uh, larger end. So you want to keep the shorter end uh, small, keep it short. So to start, I'm just going to take the wider end. I'm just going to cross over the shorter end and from here I'm going to take the wider end and go up my neck hole here and come back down I'm going to go underneath and I'm going to go down the neck hole again You should start to see that triangle being formed. From here, I'm going to take the bigger end and I'm going to cross the face. I'm going to bring it up through my neck hole and we're just going to go down that spot there. You can use your fingers to open it up. I'm just going to finish by going down. You can move it up. Pop down the collar. Then you can fix it, you can make it wider. You can make it shorter, whatever you want. Then you can just uh, hide a smaller end in the back here. But yes, that was the full Windsor knot. Uh, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to leave a like, a sub, and uh, don't forget to share this video. Uh, I'll see you all tomorrow. We got a Friday style tip. But anyways, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, have a good day.